Hi, Jamie Dury here in beautiful Southern California in San Diego, and I'm here to give you some bite-sized dreams that you will not be able to get enough of. Today, it's all about upcycling, and I've got a crusty old wooden crate here that I've upcycled into a beautiful planter. I'll tell you about that in a minute. This little thing here used to be a candle holder, and I've actually turned that into a planter with beautiful living, breathing plants. Now, I'm using Kofia the Millionaire, and my mates at Proven Winners swear by this because it really is a drought tolerant, fabulous plant. You can get this thing to flower from spring right through to frost all the way across the US, and the lovely thing about it is it attracts hummingbirds. Who doesn't like hummingbirds? It's a great plant. 16 to 18 inches high. It'll fill up that planter and give you lots of color. And I've tucked in a couple of echeverias here just to sort of fill up the gaps because I don't like bald spots in the garden. I don't think anyone does. And, and the idea of this little moss here in the front of the crate is that every plant needs to maintain its soil. So I've lined that with plastic and then I'm tucking this, just in this, just inside to cover up the plastic. And it's a great way of bringing a sense of age and character into this crusty old milk crate. And there is the finished product from the outside. Now I can finish this in a beautiful walnut stain, or I could get some white paint and milk water it down so it's nice and milky, and then rub it over with a rag so it picks up the grain, and then it'll also have a completely different look, more, more for the Cape Cod style, if you like. But this little plant here has worked out really well. I'm using this beautiful little sedum here and I've interplanted that with my echeverias. Now this is called lemon coral and the beautiful thing about it is it's given me a spillover habit and then I've got my little pink echeverias between it. But look, this stuff's very easy to buy. You can pick it up any garden center. Little bit of elbow grease and you have upcycled your garden. Try it.